Hello out there to my loyal 11 vlog subscribers. Uh, we are bringing the vlog back for New Hampshire week. Um, I think there's about 11 of you left. It's dropping every day. Yesterday I said uh, that slavery was bad on Facebook and it seems like people have taken that the wrong way or the right way and just uh, dropping in popularity by the moment here. So I am uh, on my way to New Hampshire now. Usually I stop in Stamford, Connecticut, but uh, I guess I got an earlier start than usual. And those shops were all closed by the time I was passing through. So the first stop today is in Stratford, Connecticut, the Stratford Antique Store. It's a big, um, sort of nondescript building. Yep, there it is, just super big and super nondescript. We're going to head in there and see if we have any luck finding anything. Um, yeah, let's go take a look. Don't be cheap, don't be cheap, don't be cheap, don't be cheap, don't be cheap. Oh my god, it's pretty cheap. Alright, that's a successful stop. Um, didn't really buy Americana per se. I, I, I didn't buy anything, any of the antiques that I took little clips of other than this little Philadelphia piece of ephemera. That's pretty cool. And then the other stuff I bought, I'll show you. Doing God's work. You can take the scrapper out of Delaware, but you can't make him stop buying scrap or something like that. So, um, I don't know. This stuff was just all so far under the money that I didn't really even have to weigh it. So, uh, yeah, let's throw it on the scale and see how we did. Okay, so the exciting scrap way in what everybody comes to the vlog for, not really. So we paid 335 bucks for all this scrap. Um, said the dealer it was like her first week in there. I feel a little bit bad, but not really. All right, so $335. What do we got here? All right, we got 15 ounces. 15 ounces over there. We got this sugar bowl. So what we have? We had 15 ounces so far. All right, we had 15 ounces plus another 12 and a half, 27 and a half. Oh, that's silver plate. She got me. She got me on one, boys. All right, so uh, what'd we say? Uh, 27 and a half plus six and a half is like 34 ounces. Okay, so 34 ounces for roughly 335 bucks. We only paid like 10 bucks an ounce. We also got a couple weighted pieces to add on to that, but um, even at 20 bucks an ounce, it's a little more than that right now, but um, at 20 bucks an ounce, that's like 680 bucks, so a profit of over 300 bucks. So uh, dinner's paid for, and uh, we're gonna head up to another shop. All right, so stop two today. We are in Clinton, Connecticut. Uh, let me flip the at Old Beautiful, the shop of David Pirelli, who I think is one of the best young dealers in the business. So uh, let's head inside and see if there's anything to buy. All right, so purchases from David. We've got a mirror that might be attributable to John Bellamy. I gotta look into that. A couple of pastel paintings, a Chinese jade sort of sensory planner thing that's probably not super old, but I like to gamble. And I gotta hurry up and, uh, gotta hurry up and get in the van because I, I think I parked where I'm not supposed to, I don't know. Um, next stop, I don't know, I might do another shop here in town. All right, so we made it. I uh, didn't make any more stops at shops. I am going to FaceTime the kids, then get something to eat. I got one of the very exclusive, uh, uh, maybe new, uh, pool view rooms. So you can see the pool is right there, right out the window. Very nice.
Okay, back from dinner at the Red Arrow Diner, one of my favorite places here in Manchester, and uh, gonna call it a night. Got my silver all beat up and destroyed, so plus some, um, well, I don't know plus how much, like silver and gold are diving right now, taking and just freaking tanking. Um, the silver was down like 5% in the, the Sunday evening trading, the last I looked. But, um,. I don't know, even still up um, up close to 400 bucks on that little scrap buy, so that's pretty nice. Um, yeah, bought a few other things that I kind of like, and uh, we will see what tomorrow brings at Deerfield. Uh, day one in the books.